frightened by wolves. What did you say? Much has been promised to you, hasn't it? But what has been taken from you? What do you know of your own heart? Your own life? Lay a hand on me in friendship, not quite Sharon. And I will fight the battle that has been waiting for me this last century. Then, oh then, we will have much to discuss. given me a great gift, little warrior. Don't you find it oh so curious that you would spurn your dark lady? Perhaps you feel a staring of the truth already. But that will come later. There is a battle yet to be fought. You have done what we feared was impossible. You have released me from a century of sorrow. Your power is great. So too must be your weapon. You must choose what you will wield. And the Moon Maiden will provide. Thus I have said. Thus will it be so. Are you ready? <laughs> to kill Ketheric Thorn. Sir... Go. stand for us to be here, not after what we did. Mm. Oh, yo, that song was a banger. Oh, head us. Chosen mm. Shadowheart. It's my ally. I'm shackled from shadows. She will rise in moonlit glory and carve a path of brightness to the accursed one's second death. So saith the wise Alondo. That beacon of angelic wrath has taken the fight to Catherick on the rooftop. In the first line of defense, are dead. But storming the tower won't be easy. And if we wait too long, Catherick will gather his strength and retaliate. For now, though, he's on the back foot for the first time since he returned from the grave. This is it. The spearhead moment. You brought us this far. So how shall we proceed? A 
A sound strategy. Floric left some of her flaming fist. They'll scout the prisons and the barracks below to ensure we're not taken by surprise. Say the word, and we're off. Let's get it. At the ready, Harpers. In this light, there will be victory. In this light, we will avenge the fallen. <laughs> the time has come. Gatherick will taste of death at last. Yeah. Can't be resurrected. Yo, we finna stop this game. Why <laughs> she dead? Let's not get caught off guard. You can't stall forever. All right, everybody ready? <laughs> so now would be the perfect time to use the spell. enemy let's go what you what have you done what have you done to me Retribution has come, and her sword is my sword. Ha! Catherick Thorne would sooner die than lay down his rank cause. Isn't that right, General? I was a fool to hesitate. Power like mine cannot be hidden, cannot be cowed. But power like mine has a price. A price I am destined to pay. You have one last chance to bow. Once it's gone, I'll have no choice but to destroy you both. Do you hear? In 
enough. Bro, why is she talking to My him? lord beckons me. The hell? You must return to your prison, and my daughter must be reclaimed. Your daughter? Isabel. The general will call that a tactical retreat, I'm sure. That thing he summoned was illicit. Follow it below and find him, before he has a chance to subdue the Night Song again. I certainly do. As you wish. Good hunting. Here we go. I already say for me. No longer a background murmur. The presence in your mind builds to a wall. We found it. The absolute is behind this door. The hell? You said it was under control. Crap. It isn't you I answer to, Gortash. Some new people. Motherfucker. Gortash. Oh, the general voice. Is this where we salute? Salute, yes. With cleavers through his blood-starved flesh. How it crawls with failure. Like flies on lick wet carrion. You forget yourself, Orin. I have played my part. You've built an army for our masters, true enough. But what of the astral prison? A rogue, true soul, flaunting it under your nose all this time, and you ran from him. Sure that they would follow and deliver it into my hands here. If you would cease these distractions. The distractions have been yours, Ketherick. Perhaps we never should have dug your daughter up. <sighs> so you haven't lost your edge. But you're still not as sharp as Orin, I wager. The Slayer against the Undying One. That'd be fun to see. His crypt breath sings to my sinews again, 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 again. He must lead the murder march to Border's grave. If the weapon is truly in your grasp, Ketherick, might I suggest closing your fist? Orin and I can wait for you no longer. The plan proceeds. We're going to the city, and we expect you to follow. Army and the weapon in tow. The Edict of Bane! The Lash of One of the cruelest and most powerful creatures in existence, enslaved by mere mortals. There we are. It wouldn't do to fight in front of our guest. 
Behold, Duke Ravenguard. Oh, there the he is. Absolute. Who preserve us? You wag your word flap in vain, old Aling. Once the worm holds the whip, your shredded flesh will serve us. Now, it's really time we were going. We will empty this place and begin the march. You may catch up with the army once you've retrieved the weapon. And Ketherick, do try not to sulk. You're supposed to be the fearsome general come to conquer the city. And I am the hero who will save it. Mmm. Some good plot going on. It is time, faithful ones. March on oh, We go to prepare the way. There you are, as predicted. What is it, I wonder, that draws one toward death like a moth to light? You could have run away, absconded with the prism. The one thing that could prevent me from fulfilling my destiny. But the lure of one's destiny is irresistible, isn't it? Perhaps you hope to learn your place in history before you are erased from it. A bright flash of clarity before the snuffing out. Finer champions than you have tried and failed. But perhaps they lacked the fear that drives you. Your freedom hanging in the balance. Let us speak plainly. My Lord Merkel gave me the one thing I desired, the one thing no other god could grant me. My daughter's life returned, her heart beating once more. For that, he asked that I serve as his chosen. Join Orin and Gortash to grow the cult of the Absolute, and then take control of it. He's never had a more devoted follower. I have fought great wars before, in the service of other gods and other powers. But for Merkel, I would condemn all of Faerun to death. You are all that stands between me and my destiny. And you have brought the prism here. I will kill you now. And then I will raise you as my servant. Shit. Oh, damn, by myself. Oh, yes. Repent? Would that even be possible? Perhaps. No. There is no repentance. On man? No release. My debt can never be repaid. Very can. Watching. He is listening. He is. He is. Wait, did I just convince him to off himself? You dare end one who belongs to me. Oh snap, I didn't have to fight him. Let's go.
Yeah. Chosen. But it is no matter, for I am death, and I am not the end. I am a beginning. All right, then. Shit. So they're still safe. Still on my feet. Oh my god, seven health. Come on, this is it. Just like that. Just like that. <sighs> Was it too bad? sword my fealty do what you must and we fly this foul place hmm. the chosen of Merkel is dead yeah do it in death the body is cooling but energy radiates from the stone Remarkable, truly. She ate it. And now the picture comes together. The absolute is neither God nor man. It is the elder brain you saw, held here by those three against its will. The crown it wears controls it, and these stones control the crown. It has been dominated. To master an elder brain, to subdue it, our enemies are formidable. What are these stones? The crown's markings suggest it was forged in Netheril, an ancient empire whose mastery over magic rivaled that of the gods. It is a crown of domination. The stones were taken from its crest. They are nether stones, imbued with the ability to control the wearer of the crown. The crown's netherese magic must be the true source of the parasite's abilities. This must be what elevates their potential. And it must be the reason nobody could heal you. If the crown can do this to the parasite, I dare not imagine what it is doing to the brain. A temporary reprieve, but a welcome one. With a brain on its way to the city, its influence here is weakened. One of them I know, Lord Enver Gortash, an arms dealer and a slaver, a worshipper of Bane, the god of tyranny. The other is a mystery to me, but the way she spoke, it is most likely she follows Baal, god of murder. Ketherick was a follower of Merkel, which means the absolute is a front for the gods of death, and our enemies are the chosen of the dead three. Bane, Baal, and Merkel. 
The tyrant, the assassin, and the necromancer. They are known to pick from their most devout followers, the chosen, granting them incredible powers. Each one alone would be a formidable enemy. But working together and controlling an elder brain, I dare not imagine what they might achieve. We prepare for the fight of our lives, and the lives of everyone in Faerun. The army of the Absolute is marching on Baldur's Gate. Within the city, an elder brain, brimming with power, ready to turn everyone within its reach into mind flayers. All it needs is an order, an order the Death Gods Chosen are on the cusp of giving. We must wrest control of the brain from the Chosen before that happens. We must take their stones. Our chances of success are slim, but we must not fail. If we fail, everything ends. I will be your shield, but you must be the sword. And when the chance comes to strike, you must take it, for there may only be one chance. A debt repaid. You returned my life unto me. Now go and claim your own. <coughs> it hurts. Shah torments you still. What a spiteful creature she is. This will not stop until you take action. See that your parents' sacrifices are not in vain. Allow the Moon Maiden to guide you at last. Yo, what the? The hell?